There are few things I enjoy more than finding a small slice of time to dust off the trail bike, slide on the helmet and go for a trail ride somewhere very, very green. Within moments, there is nothing in your head than the sound of your own bike. And my two riding buddies couldn't agree more. You know the song, Sisters Are Doing It For Themselves? Well, not only are Rosie Lalon and Lee Hutton actual sisters, but they want to see more girls doing what they've grown up doing. You guys are very good riders. How did you get into it? Well, we started riding in Canada. We're originally from Canada, and then we moved to Australia. My parents, our parents both raced. We were actually show jumping horses, which is also a really good sport, and we saw that there were a lot of boys in dirt biking, so we were kind of <laughs> like, hmm, no the guys in horses? And there's lots of those blokes in the... The female to male ratio is a lot better in the, in the off-road motorcycle world, so... Smart girls. And, and we like the bikes as yeah, well. Yeah. Yeah. The bikes are cool. <laughs> The girls race competitively and have even competed in the four-day Australian Enduro Championships. And they're just as passionate about trail riding in the Great South East. Uh, you know a lot of girls, I don't like riding on the road. I don't trust drivers out there, so when I can get out in the trail riding with, you know, my family, my boyfriend, and it's a lot of fun, so it's definitely a family, family sport. And the fashion, you know, I, I love my pink and yeah. you know you can look good while our getting dirty. Is a big so. part of it. We design our bikes all up and we make sure all our gear matches and it's good, you know, when you pass the boys on the trail and you're wearing pink gear, it definitely gets a few heads turned. Lee and Rosie are putting the call out to young girls to join them. The first step of course is a license. Team Moto Motorcycle Riding School Springwood offers a three-day learn-to-ride course. It's designed for those with little or no experience, and by the afternoon of the first day, they are confident they'll have you on the road. That's better. If you are even just a little bit curious about the very fun world of motorcycles, have a chat to the guys and girls at Team Moto. They can help you out with anything with two wheels and a motor. And at the end of three days, you'll be picking out your own snazzy gear. Any tips for the girls starting off? I think don't be scared to go out and have a go. Like, that's the main thing. You know, I, go, I fell over today. I fall over all, every time I go out riding. And, you know, just getting out there and having fun. And you'll, you'll be so surprised with, um, you know, how confident you'll feel after you are on the bike for a few, you know, days, hours, doesn't matter. Well, now I've got that, I reckon it's about time I can uh, do a bit of expression session and a bit of freestyle, hey? Okay, let's see it. I reckon I've got it. Okay, watch away your, you go. Watch your foot now. Okay. <laughs> I got a little loose on that second air up there, but yeah, the nose started to bleed a bit, so I thought I'd better settle down. I think I got the hang of it. 